Oh, that's right, baby. I I had a feeling this was coming today. Uh, I did not get a good night's sleep. Uh, let's just put it at that. Maybe four hours at best. Let's hope for four legend reviews at best. We have the gameplay trailer. It is here after long discussion. Is it real? Is it ever going to come? It is in fact real. And it is in fact coming right now. I might come. After this video, of course, you know, probably not suitable for YouTube. Leave likes, subscribe to the channel. A lot of MLB 21 news coming up soon. Of course, we are sub one month, sub 30 days from MLB 21. Gameplays, tips, pack openings, everything on this channel. And uh, yeah, ignore my hair for a second. And fuck, man, uh, I'm just excited. You know what I mean? We'll slap this baby in 4K. And let's get dirty. Here we go. I'm expecting uh, quite substantial stuff right here. Let me just... Uh, okay, that seemed rather fast. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we were just in 120 FPS. Good Christ, this game looks good. Lindor. Arenado. Good stuff to see right there. Blake Snell. Yes. Okay, no new legends so far. We see Trevor Story. Is he going to be on the Rockies uh, this whole year? Hopefully not. Uh, pray for Trevor's story that he's not stuck on that team. We have Mondi. Um, of course, uh, Robert right there. Mookie Betts. Gameplay it looks, well, like the visuals look outstanding. You know, really. This is, of course, on next gen. Shit looks really good. Looks really good. We got Bulba the FPS is really rocking. This isn't exactly gameplay. Um, but of course, you know, we know this at this point. Uh, seeing some cool stuff right here. No? Just seeing visuals. Otani back on the mound. Hopefully he has a big season this year. Big fly, Otani-san. Uh, Gilito. There we go. That's what we came here to see. Kevin Kiermeyer in the gameplay trailer. I'm hyped now. I don't care if we get Derek Jeter in the reveal at the end of the video. I'm ha I saw Kevin Kiermaier. Gomes is happy. You checked all the boxes for me. Uh, yeah, I mean, they're really not reinventing the wheel right here. That's pretty cool. I'd like to see that. Hopefully, Judge is going to be doing a lot of uh, jump shot fadeaways. Not against the Reyes, but, you know, other team. Against the Red Sox. I'll be happy with that. Wander Franco. There we go. That's cool to see. You know, we have uh, Independence Day, you know, invading. Yeah, they said something at the end of the trailer, so oh, we're just getting a One Piece. Yeah, there's Clemente. There we go, man. I'm happy. That's cool. Made it no secret. Big fan of Roberto Clemente. Uh, he's going to be at the game. So that is officially confirmed. Uh, that's cool. I am... A little bit, uh, I'll talk about this uh, quickly. Um, I'll just kind of have this play in the background here. I'll even have slight audio on there. Um, actually, I'm, I don't know if that's a good idea I, for copyright reasons. Uh, but here's my thing. Uh, I, I've talked about this now at this point. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I think we should prepare ourselves for the consideration that we don't get 30 new legends. You know, if we think about in terms of the gameplay trailer, for example, I think last year we saw, uh, you know, we saw, of course, holy shit, we saw somebody big at the end of the end of the trailer, Mickey Mantle, no, it was uh, David Ortiz and Mariano Rivera. We saw some, like, five, six legends, we saw one today, you know, we saw just Roberto Clemente, big reveal, very happy, I think there's a good shot that he is going to be the collection reward. I think we have to start preparing ourselves for 15, 10, 15 legends. I, I think that is pretty realistic. Again, I talked about, you know, when the game's going to release. I think it is officially 25, 24 days uh, away. And they have, I think, four more streams, including a Diamond Dynasty stream. Um, but what I talked about on stream, which, you know, we probably will be streaming to again today, twitch.tv slash gomes to legend. Follow if you want to grow a little couple more hairs on your sack, maybe. Um, but yeah, I think there's a good shot that we get a uh, reduced amount of legends compared to previous years based off this. And I don't know. 
it kind of is what it is. Hopefully, they're adding more stuff on the back end to Diamond Dynasty to uh, kind of circumvent the issue of maybe not having too much exciting content. Um, but I do want to talk about this again as we see Wander Franco. Uh, do we get his Future Stars card this year, or is it going to be delayed to the next year? Who knows? Um, but uh, this is cool. Like I said, um, Stadium Creator, again, is only on next gen. Um, they didn't show anything too new. They really only showed celebrations, which I guess is kind of par for the course. They, you know, don't typically, uh, you know, reveal all their, you know, little secrets and tidbits uh, within these gameplay trailers that are more or less just, you know, sizzle reels of you know, highlights that you could expect to see. You know, maybe some of those things could actually happen within gameplay. Um, but yeah, pieces like that are rather cool. Um, still gonna have to see if you can use these stadiums for online play, like ranked seasons play. That is not confirmed. I think that's gonna be the case, um, but, you know, I'm gonna hold my tongue until we have official confirmation for that. And, uh, yeah, like I said, available on 420, of course, you know. Make sure and, uh, I don't know, get your doctor's note in now, because, trust me, there's already plenty of people that miss work, miss school due to 420 every year and now that there's MLB the show coming in uh, better go ahead and <laughs> better go ahead and claim that uh, you know pretty quick so uh, is cool Roberto Clemente I am happy about that um, but again you know we're just going to have to see uh, if nothing else just kind of rest on the fact that we are going to get a big year of legends next year just because it is uh on multiple consoles on xbox and playstation multiple sources of revenue at that point they're you know, simply going to earn more money basic uh economics really um but yeah I, I guess i'll just show quickly again really what i mean um they didn't show that much a bit of a letdown i, I love clemente i love seeing these new faces different places you know like, Arunado actually getting a chance to win for his first time in his career. Uh, you know, graphics look good. The FPS looks good. Again, this is not really in-game footage. Some of it is just in the replay room, I can tell. And some of it is, uh, you know, manufactured like you would see in any other uh, video game trailer. It is, uh, you know, in-engine footage, but not gameplay footage. Um, so, yeah, the game looks good. Um, Clemente, uh, but otherwise we didn't really see anything too new, uh, outside, I guess you could, you know, kind of say that's the strafing feature that they integrated and we saw in the, uh, fielding new feature stream, um, Bauer, a couple celebrations, like I said, hopefully I would love to see Tatis take Bauer deep numerous times this year. And then Clemente, so, um, let me know how cool this reveal was to you guys, um, I'm happy, you know, Clemente was, uh, was on my list for quite some time of Legends I Want, and scratch him off that list. Now let's look for Joe Creedy. Thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy it, leave a like down below. Comment what you guys think about what I said. You know, Do you think there's a shot that we get a reduced amount of Legends this year? And if that's the case, do you think Clemente's the big one? I still think Jeter's a possibility. Let me know what you guys think as far as that and everything else goes. As always, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for um, you know continuing the support on this weird year where there hasn't been too much news. Um, so it's kind of been tough to figure out stuff to make videos on. But uh, thank you for watching. Leave a like down below. Hope you guys have a great day. Here comes out eight.